information that there may be some items of evidentiary value here uh, at this address in anyway, so. So it's been a full day of digging here by police. Uh, they used a backhoe, uh, a lot of piles of dirt, and now they're filling that back in. So we're still waiting to hear if they found anything and if it's directly related to the missing persons case of Mr. Victor Flores. Heidi and Christina. So, a lot you've been talking about where they were digging and a neighbor saying that they saw the digging previously, but how did police know where they should start that digging when they got out there today? Yeah, police aren't saying exactly why they were led back to this home, but uh, neighbors do say that they remember that uh, Victor Flores, that he was known around this neighborhood at least for a couple of weeks. And police say that they used what they call a penetrating ground sonar to decide where to dig. And they say something led them to where they were digging, but they, they dug very deep. They used shovels for a little bit, but then they got a backhoe in and went at least eight feet down. So whatever they were looking for was very deep in the ground. And, Lad, we saw in your video that they were carrying away buckets full of soil. Have they been looking through that dirt, or what are they doing with it? Initially, when they were using shovels, they were doing the shovel full into the bucket so they could easily see if they found something. But then they got the backhoe, and the backhoe was putting that dirt on a flatbed truck, and then they were sifting through it with shovels, and then ultimately putting the piles of dirt out here on the road. Uh, a lot of dirt was removed from that hole, uh, and uh, they did come in with some brown bags that are used for evidence, but we never saw those bags come back out full of anything. So they're not saying if they found anything. So a lot of questions and mystery surrounding yeah. this case. All right. All right, lad, thank you so much.